Well, I saw another cave where there was like these um, catfish that were completely blind, and they're in the bottom of this cave, and it's the only place in the world where you see get these catfish. There's no other place in the world where you have them. Are you kidding? There's a way down there. Usually always is in Thailand. Yeah, oh yeah, that'd definitely be a way down there. Yeah. You can use my flight. I've got to talk to my phone. Yeah, I think Lex got one as well. She said she'd get a phone. I think. We'll see how it goes, yeah. See any bats yet? Hmm. Because you do see them quite clearly, like on the top of the top of stuff. And this is daytime, so nocturnal animals. So they're doing yeah, somewhere. This is a bit too bright for them here. <laughs> It was stunk like it was stunk like crazy because uh, they're all shitting in there. So it was full of sheep, about you know fifty or to hundred sheep, and the whole floor was covered in dung. I went in about a meter and I was like, oh my god, it's full of poo. <laughs> oh. Wow. Oh. Oh, this torch just keeps on flickering on and off. I've got my phone with me. Cool. Please do not post. Let's post this area. <laughs> but you know you've got to go past this area. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Pretty good light, this, isn't it? I think it's the first time I actually remembered this torch in the cave. There's usually some quite adventurous bits in these caves. Whoa. Oh, yeah, I, don't, I don't feel like posting today anyway, so. There must be something fun down there for telling you that though. <laughs> yeah, it might be. Well, that's it, shine it in her eyes, and I'll see nothing. <laughs> Do not post. You know what? I wonder what's down there. I wonder what's down there. This looks very, uh, oh, it's all right. It's, it's not steep at all here. It's just it's a flat as it is back there. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow, that's amazing, that is. There's sometimes little arrows sent around in some of the caves before, but they're like hidden. You have to literally find them. Oh, that's impressive. What happened there? There's a big drop. Ooh. Oh wow, so this is, this is, this is quite, this is quite impressive, aren't they? This glittering. Oh yeah. Just think this is a, little baths have been formed over. Yeah, yeah. So I believe you leave a, this is dripping tap. It's incredible. Oh, there's an arrow pointing that way. So. Yeah, I see it. Right, 
You know, um, Winsome Caves in Lao. Very impressive, actually. Yeah. And some people have chiseled away at these to seal them. Yeah. 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 Yeah, well, the thing is, like, it's, um, it ain't going to happen again anytime soon, so, like, uh, yeah. Oh, God, yeah, I can smell it. Wow. It's a big, it's a big ch Yeah, that's right, yeah, it's like little dung. It's like little rolls of shit. Yeah, it's probably a couple of birds. Oh, so you can go down there, you go around by your arrow and down into that yeah. hole again. Oh. It's great they give you the, the opportunity today to get up somewhere like this and yeah. up close, isn't it? No one here. No yeah. One here at all. yeah. They'll let you down here on your own if they, if they were. Yeah. They wouldn't look for you for about 10 days. <laughs> yeah, you, can, you can go down there, we can go down, around the side and down. But this way. Yeah, there's a way, there's arrows down there. It is actually, I think. Yeah, this, this, even this chamber alone is just sort of more impressive, I think. No, I mean, this sort of thing is Quite smooth, isn't it? The surface. This train hasn't got big grip either. <laughs> wow, what's oh, cool down here? Oh, the best shoes for grip. Oh shit, this is slippy. These trays are terrible grip. No, not on this rock anyway. Ooh. Yeah, go on, yeah, definitely. Um, I didn't, didn't only sprayed a tiny little bit on, you see, so I wasn't really prepared for. Uh, I didn't think there'd be any down here. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's those. I think if uh, you don't need a sign to tell you if it's coming at you. <laughs> I think if it's too late, you go. And so there's quite a few rocks that have fallen down there over time, isn't there? That pile of them. I don't think I'm going down there. Is it, is, is, which way do we go? I'm not, I think I'm, I think that's the end of it. Oh, really? I think so. Yeah, it might be. There's no way out from there, right, Nick? No, no. Uncle, you there? No. No. Good. 
I think this is the one who's that pretty much. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's good in the pocket oh. there. Wow, look at that. Bloody hell, that's a good picture. That's a picture. Yeah, that's a good picture. I'm sure really? I should have held my belly in there. Well, it's quite, it's quite some size, isn't it, the old uh, yeah. rock? <laughs> the belly. <laughs> <laughs> They left the sun shining through the hole up there. I thought there was another hole. Mm. Yeah. There's not there's nothing else down there. Yep, the I'm gonna make my go down there actually. Have a quick Yeah, I've got a good bit on. Yeah, they're all round though. I've seen another one. A I saw there's a break in the one over there as well. What if someone, uh, oh, I mean, oh well, <laughs> yeah, they're very brutal. These are, I've seen someone whack the head off from before and they uh, split the head open straight away, like they went Ooh, like bang, like a big point, it just goes like, driving a nail through your head. Yeah, they cut the head really badly, the head bleeds quite badly as well. Yeah. It's a, um, it's actually the defense mechanism that is of all things. It's a way of the brain protecting itself, bizarrely enough. So it splits the skin, so, it does, so the shock doesn't send through, go to the bone or brain. So the skin splits so easily on the brain, on the head, sorry. That's why if you ever get into a fight with someone, you should never hit them over the head with anything, because you'll give them about eight stitches. <laughs> and even if you use no force at all. Um, the head was split open like a, co like a skin of an apple. It's an impressive looking cave though, I've got to say, it's, yeah, there's not much to it, but like this, the chambers are very, very impressive. If this was in England now, you'd be coming through a, a ramp, everything would be, it would be, everything would be uh, fenced off, and then you'd have the pink lights and everything. <laughs> Which is good in some ways, but also it's, uh, it's uh, sad that you can't get uh, up, up close and personal with something. Yeah. Because this is like a bit of an adventure, really, you know. Like next time, it's going to be great. Yeah. Definitely. Phones aren't too bad these days, mm. but, you know, they're still not as good as, like, you know, it's pretty dull. Mm. All right. They'll get you through the spot. But yeah, if you want to enjoy things that were better, you know, torch is a lot better. Ooh, yeah. So are we, um... Do we get a pass to all the I I I things around here now? I don't think so. Oh. Maybe not. I don't know. I doubt it. <laughs> yeah, I doubt it very much. So. Do you remember once when I was... Look at that shiny piece there. Oh, yeah. So shiny. Amazing. It's not bad. It's not bad at all, really. Anyways. I was reading about this uh, tube.